This is the one if you're suffering with high blood pressure. Nature is at hand once again, and this time it's been scientifically proved. Raw beetroot must be raw. Do not juice with cooked beetroot. One, it doesn't have anywhere near the same effect. More importantly, it sucks. It really tastes awful. Remember, we want to make sure that these taste good and do you good. And once again, ease the pressure, which is what this recipe is called. Take it from the book, the Funky Fresh Juice Book, of course. And I've had so much feedback from this particular recipe from people that said, you know what? It really helps every single time. Loaded with nitrates, widens the blood vessels, oxygen intake is improved. Now I've got two bulbs of beetroot. In the recipe, you'll see it says three small bulbs of beetroot. These are big, so I'm just using two substantial size beetroot bulbs. Couple of apples, what you're gonna require as well. And unusually, I've got some grapes going in as well here. You don't need a juicer, you don't need a blender. Very simple, very straightforward. I would pop an apple in first. If you have a fast juicer, you wanna put the apple in first. I haven't even started to juice yet. And now what you wanna do is then you wanna put the grapes in now. You wanna maximize the juice that you get from the grapes. Now, of course, for many years, I used to love grape juice, but it was fermented grape juice. <laughs> uh, very different to this. This is the stuff that really does you good. Raw beetroot going in, and then I would just start to start juicing away at that point. So just allow the cold pressed juicer to do its thing. Gonna add the other beetroot bulb in. And then we can just start to release all of the juice. The apple should be the last thing going in. And there it is, there's the ease the pressure. The glass, I don't know why, whenever I'm having anything with grape juice in, I just think it deserves a wine glass. I don't know why that is. Bit of ice going in, again, not essential, it's up to you. And just look at the color here, rich. Now beetroot juice by itself is too earthy. It's, it's really earthy. That's why we've added the apple going in as well and grape juice by itself is just a little bit too sweet. Now you think you've added apple in, but it's much, much sweeter. Look at this. These are different. I don't make these recipes all the time. So when we start filming on a day like today, it's often I haven't made this one since I wrote the book. You can't remember how good it looked and it looks incredible. It's staying stable. Uh, that's largely down to the fact we use the cold press juicer. Uh, if you haven't, you want to make sure you drink it as close to making it as possible. Um, and again, it's a meal in a glass. Please sip it slowly. You want to sip it slowly, like, as they say, a fine wine, so to speak, but you don't want to gulp it down. So a little try. Oh, it's just on every level. I don't know how to, what else can you say? Yeah, I can taste the beetroot. Yes, it's earthy, but the apples have beautifully balanced that out and the grapes give that added sweetness. This is the one for high blood pressure if you're suffering, and I'm not telling you to get off of drugs or anything else. I'm not a doctor, I'm not claiming to be, and it's all nature, and there are no side effects, no drugs involved, and it tastes really good too. Ease the pressure, the one for blood pressure, taken from the Funky Fresh Juice Doctor. Thanks for watching. If you like what you saw, more of the same over here. Latest video over here. Don't forget to subscribe and to like, and please share what you see.